Welcome back. Happy Tuesday night. Um, I told a couple of my brothers in the club that I would start doing a series of Tyrannus videos to help them get along setting stuff up from scratch and whatnot. Um, our good friend JC, which is Pro Project Blue Falcon, um, God rest his soul, he did a great, great series, which is probably going to be better than what I'm about to do. Uh, and I'll put a link to that, bam, right there. So, but anyway, we're going to, I'm going to sectionalize this. So first one's going to be system parameters, then model setup, then blah, 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 blah. It's going to be multiple videos in a playlist, okay? So hopefully you guys can all see this. The first one here, bam, is going to be system parameters. So what we're going to do, we're going to zoom in here a little bit, like that, and power on your QX7. Okay. First thing we're going to do is go through system parameters, okay? Hold down the menu key right here for a couple seconds, and then you get into it. I'm going to zoom in a little bit more. There we go, okay? Date, y'all figure that out. Not too tough. Time, same principle. My time isn't even close to the right time. I don't care. Battery range, you may want to change this if you're running a LiPo battery versus a nickel, you know, or whatever type of battery you're running. And you hit this button here, and you can change that. Hit it again, it goes away. Sound. And I'm only going over in detail the parameters that might actually be useful, okay? Uh, sound, mode, all. If we hit enter on that, no key. Now my, my beeping went away, okay? We can go all, or we can, yeah, so that's that. Volume is volume, beep volume, which you can hear right there. Beep length, so if you want it to be longer. See, I usually don't even have the beep on. So I'm going to turn that off. I'm looking at the camera on here, so it's, you know, tricky. All right. Beep pitch, you can change the pitch. <laughs> Pretty cool. Wave volume, so... When your Tyrannus is talking to you, the chick voice, and we're gonna go over how to download all that stuff later. This is how loud she squawks at you or nags at you, okay? BG volume, bang good? I can't remember, doesn't matter. Uh, Vario, eh, we don't care about any of this stuff. You can change the pitch. It's almost a little too, too many settings can be bad too. Uh, haptic, mo haptic mode is the little vibration that you feel on the side, which I do always do. And again, you can select all, or you can hit no key, so it doesn't actually vibrate when you hit the keys. I always have that on all. You don't have to, though. And then the length of the haptic value, you know, haptic, sorry. Woo, long day. Uh, and the strength of it. Okay. Contrast, obviously, if we hit enter on that, that's contrast, okay? This is gonna change relative to how bright it is outside. Alarms, battery low, 6.5 volts in this case. Inactivity, I do find this one pretty useful. You know, if you haven't touched your transmitter in five minutes, it'll start beeping at you, because I do do that. I'll be sitting at my desk, I'll be di dialing in a bird on beta flight or something, and I'll have this thing on, and I'll forget that it's on. And uh, it used to be on 10 minutes, but now I have it set for 5, so that's kind of cool. Memory low. I don't know how the hell you would do that, but okay. Sound off. You know, that's the same principle. RSSI shutdown. Blah, blah, blah. Um, I'm skipping this stuff. You guys can figure this little shit out for yourselves. It's not a big deal. Splash screen. When you saw me boot up, I'm going to hold this down. Snooze. Come on. I think my power button's stuck. I need to uh, <laughs> fix that. That's your splash screen. JJ wrote a D in this case, okay? So, 
go back down here. Let's see. Splash screen. So how long do you want that little JJ Roto Geek or whatever yours is saying to go? Time zone, useless. Adjust RTC. GPS coordinates, if you're using GPS drone. Us in the US are going to use DMS. United States. Voice language, English. When you download the voice, uh, the voice pack on your SD card, which we'll get into that in a later video, um, it comes with Swedish, German, and blah de blah de blah. Uh, you don't have to mess with that. English for me. Units, Imperial or Metric. We all should be on Metric, but America's stupid. So play delay. Uh, USB mode, ask. Do you want it to basically boot up in joystick mode for simulator or SD card, which would be for uh, you know running the software? I always have it to say ask. Receiver channel, order, which is aileron, you know, blah, 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 blah. You can have this. This is your default menu for how you want to set up when you do your sticks in beta flight. Okay. So aileron, throttle, you know, all that good stuff. So that's that. I think. Oh, okay. And then mode, mode two, mode three, mode four. Most of us fly mode two. Not all of us. Uh, mode two is your throttle on the right. And then your roll, pitch. And then your yaw over here. Uh, most of us do mode two or mode one. Uh, let's see, battery range. You can change that. Your sound modes, beep volumes. Yeah, and this is all repeats. That's it. Okay. Page up. All right. Notice right here. That was only page one. I'm gonna hold down the menu key. That is one of nine. If I hit the page up button again, it goes to page two. So there's your e crossfire if you're running that. I'm not going to get into that. I am not an expert on crossfire. Your EEPROM, we can hit that. EEPROM, blah, 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 tells you when it was made. Ugh, my bad. Okay. Page up. Firmware version you're running. Logs, models, screenshots, quads, readme, and wing. You know, nothing, nothing fantastic there. Okay. Page up again, screenshots, scripts, sounds, SXR, system volume information. Yeah, you guys can go through all that. I never even play with that screen. Page one is the one I use most of the time. Three global functions. We'll get into this at a later date. Um, this is all for more advanced than this video is going to be. But later on, when I get into the advanced, we'll go ahead and go through those. Trainer mode, which I don't use. Firmware version, blah, 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 blah. Your date that it was updated. Enter long backup. Menu long factory set. Factory reset, which is very handy to have. So if you screw the pooch like our brother Demi in the club does all the time, you might want to do factory reset. Uh, but you can do enter as, as a long backup. So hold this is enter over here. That guy. Hold that down. It just did a backup. Bam, that fast, pretty cool. All right, so page up again. Uh, switches, page keys, blah, blah, blah. Usually I, I, I personally don't mess with this. Um, analogs, A1, A34, battery calibration. You can actually calibrate your battery if, the, uh, if it's reading something that, like if you take a meter, meter out your battery in the back and then plug it back in. And if your radio is saying something different, like in my case, 7.5 volts. Let's just say my meter, when I meter out the battery, says 9 volts. I can calibrate it at that page, okay? Which I don't fuck with, <laughs> honestly. Uh, let's see, battery calibration. And then hardware sticks, okay? Elevator. You can name, you can name them. Um, this is stuff that's very, very rarely used and enter to start. And this is to calibrate your sticks, okay? So we hit this. Set sticks to midpoint. There we go. Enter when done. Move sticks and pots. Move them in all directions. Let me zoom out. Oops, shit, sorry. Okay. And then you also wanna move the pots. All the way around. That pot's sticky. I don't use my pots on mine. 
so I don't really care a whole lot. No big deal. Hit enter when done. Enter to start. All right. So, there we go. That's it. That is the system menu. Now, I know I didn't go through every single parameter, and that's fine. Um, I went through the stuff that you're normally going to use. Nine times out of ten, guys, you're going to be using page one, and that is it. <laughs> Nine times out of ten. I don't get, you know, as much as a geek as I am, I really don't get that anal with with the radio. You know, yeah, I like it to talk. It says, like, you know, flaps up, flaps down. that's for my turtle mode. Okay, things like that. Um, but yeah, I don't get real anal with this, guys. So, uh, but I'm gonna do some basic videos. Excuse me, system setup, system uh, parameters, uh, how to create a model, and so on and so forth. That are gonna be nice and basic for people like me. And then I will delve into the more advanced functions of the Tyrannix QX, Tyrannus QX7. So. Until next time, kids, this is video one. I'm going to try to do one every day if I can, so until we're done. So take care, keep shining side up. Bam. <laughs>